champion, campeon. Are you where na lapana? Are you trusting God for healing? If so, stay tuned. Sambana and Mzanzi, Tobala and Mzanzi, Dumala and Mzanzi. Bon dia, Africa the Soul. Good day, good day to all of you talented, gifted, and potentialful campeones, champions out there. My name is William George Moises, and welcome to King in Me. Not killing me, man. Not killing me. King in Me. Christ in us, the hope of glory. And um, yeah, joining me today for Winning Wednesdays, Winning Woman Wednesdays, mm, special yes. edition, just for all the ladies <laughs> out there. Okay, Winning. Woman Wednesdays with Champion Moira. Again, thank you so much for being here. Excited to have you here. Thank and you. we'd love to just hear a bit about what God has done in your life, please, if you would. Okay, awesome. So I'll try to sum up the past five years in five minutes. Come on, um, there we go. Okay, so in 2014, I was diagnosed with TB and um, yo, my life just dramatically changed from there as that was the beginning of my five-year health journey. Sure. And from there, I just grew more and more ill and the doctors couldn't explain or you, they didn't know what was happening with me. And the last two years, I've actually been on bed rest every day, living in a room and that's it. All I yeah. had was social media and my Bible. Oh, snap. And that's Hopefully where... you chose the Bible over the over the yes. social. There yes. you go. Come on, high five, bring it in. <laughs> well, that's otherwise it. I wouldn't be here today. Amen. Come on, thank which you, is Jesus. Awesome. Yeah. There we go. So my relationship just grew stronger um, because when you hit rock bottom, the only mm. way only way you can look is up, and that's oh, wow. exactly what I did. And yeah, so being in hospital every single week, um, I had to go to Santon to um, find a doctor, which was really expensive, but sure. no other doctor could help me, and there was a team of doctors that actually helped me and did tests mm. on me mm. and yeah it was they had to import medicine from Germany for me because there was nothing in South Africa that could actually help my body mm. and um, yeah I did I went through every medical test that you can think of that mm. looks painful I went through that mm. and um, yeah at the end of the day they couldn't find anything wrong with me and um, it was to a point where some of the doctors told me um, it was in the beginning phase of lupus mm. and then also wanted to die diagnosed me with B cell lymphocyte cancer. And so yeah, the, my quality of life was just degrading every single day. Mm. And one mm. of the doctors actually told me that um, I'm now 23 and he told me that my life expectancy would not go to 25. Sure. And so preparing in that sense that I am going to die, I just couldn't take it anymore. Mm. Mm. And yeah, so um, the one day in hospital, God just, um, I just told him I can't do this anymore. I need him sure. and phoned a friend, told her I can't do this. I know. Um, um, I deserve better than this life. Mm. And yeah, she prayed for me and God instantaneously healed me. Come on, thank and you Jesus. Yeah, That's today it. I'm yes, living, doing things mm. for the first time in five years sure. and it's all honor to God. Amen, thank you Jesus. So they yes. said that you were only gonna make it up to what age? 25. And how old are you now? I'm turning 24. Oh, come on, So man. I just made it. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> High five. Yes, yes, yes. God ultimately, fam, is a healer, all right? He mm. is Jehovah Rapha. So I don't know, maybe if you perhaps trust in God for healing in your physical body, or maybe it's not even a physical matter. Maybe it's something to do spiritually, emotionally, relationally, mm. financially even perhaps. Just know today, Namshlanja, that God is a healer. He has a living testimony of someone who was healed by the power of the living God. Mm. So I just really feel that I want us just to simply just pray for the people that are mm. watching this who maybe who would yes. need healing so father we just say thank mm. you right now just for whoever's watching this yeah. lord god that they would receive a touch from you mm. and that they would yes. be healed father god through your power lord god in jesus name thank you that through your stripes lord jesus that we are healed yes. and father god thank you for wholeness over every individual that's watching this lord jesus we bless you we thank yes. you for the many testimonies that will come from this and we just give you all the glory we give you all the praise and we give you all the honor in Jesus mighty name we pray and we say amen, amen. and amen and amen. Champions, just know today, we're not watching this, okay? We're not watching this. Know today, Namhlanje, that your life matters both to God and to us.